defense accepts the penalty. This next play coming from the 47-yard line. First down at the 47. Brown's got it on a pass. Had some heat on it. My gosh, the wide receivers in the NFL now, it's just, it's incredible. It's not that you have one. Every team has two and three, and some have four. Good job that time by him hauling in that pass. The Steelers now inside the 20. A week ago, they converted time and time again inside the red zone. Well, when you have a tie game and you're down in the red zone, you can do whatever you want. You can pull it with a run here, or you can take a chance and throw the football in the end zone to get a score. Nothing really seems to be going right for this guy lately, Phil. He struggled to run the football last week, and he continues the same today. Yeah, it's all of the above, Jim. And what I mean by that, it's the running back's fault. It's the offensive line's fault. And let's give a little credit to the defense. They've done a good job stopping the run. The game is tied, and time is a factor. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Jim, I love these situations. Third and goal, what are they going to call? They're going to run the football, they're going to go with the pass, and if it is a pass, I will look for something quick. They will snap it now at the seven-yard line. Tie game here in the late going, and the defense needs to make a stop. They cannot give up the big play right now. Runs it across for the touchdown. At the most critical time, they've found the end zone and taken the lead. It's up to the defense now to hold on to it. Yeah, that's what they've done. They put the pressure on their defense, go out there and finish this game off. And they, hey, look, you always got to feel good as a defensive player when you take the field with the lead. Driving extra point is good. Brown's probably ready to get right back on the field after that last drive. A drive in which he contributed over 40 yards receiving, helping the team score. No return. The ball's coming out to the 20. Close game right now, partner, and you look at the matchup and running back, and neither one of them has really been all that effective. No, Jim, they have not been. I'll say this to the running backs, to the coaches, to the offensive line, everybody. Stay patient, stay with the run game, and I think it will work. Time is running out. The defense knows it's playing with the lead, but doing whatever it can to just try to run out the clock. And on the mark with Golden Tate. Lions did a good job there on first down. That pass picks up some good solid yards. Now second and short. Much easier to call those kind of plays. Thompson's completion percentage, 70% on the day. After the pass play, gain seven. Second and three on the way. This is a time where the quarterback has to manage the clock. Has to be very careful. Trailing, needing points to get back into this one. Launching it deep. Is it caught? Yes, the offense has the ball. Johnson seemingly caught everything thrown his way today, Phil. He has caught everything thrown his way, Jim. Listen, this guy has some of the best hands in the NFL. This game is closing in on a finish, and the defense can make one play and basically end the game. We're back now as the defense will try to keep the offense off the board. Late here in the fourth. Now on first down. Every snap crucial the rest of the way. To Ebron. And that's a gain of 10. That's his third catch of the day. First down. Pressure on every snap now. Good job by the offense going to hurry up offense. You do this to get the plays in, but also you want to conserve the timeouts. Anytime a receiver gets open in the NFL, the coaches expect the football to be completed. That's just not a very good job that time by the quarterback. 
before we go any further. They're going to take another look at the last play. There's no question he caught the ball, but there is a question whether or not he got both feet in bounds. Well, first off, you want to make sure it's a clean catch on the sidelines. Does he have possession of the football? And then once you declare he has possession of the football, let's look down at both feet, see if they're in bounds, and don't forget, you must, must maintain possession of the football as you go to the ground. So the boys in the booth, they want to make doubly sure the call was correct under two minutes they decided hey we, we need to take another look at this but the play stands as is yeah jim it was a good challenge upstairs by the officials uh, it was not clear cut but once we have seen the play in slow motion replay well now it's clear cut now take the target with the catch takes tackle down after a gain of 15. now a first down every snap crucial the rest of the way good job by the offense here hustle up Get that football snap. Touchdown, Detroit. Takes caught his first touchdown of the season. The short touchdown toss all but ties this game up in the final two minutes. Yeah, it's a good call. You know, you had the defense guessing. They didn't. And we're going to have a stoppage here because the booth wants to have a look at this potential touchdown. The touchdown will stand. The Lions have come back late in this one. An extra point away from tying it up. And the point after is good. It's as tight as it can be. The game all square in the final moments. Yeah, but you, when the game gets in this situation, Jim, which coach has the courage to call that play that's a little daring? They could backfire, but if it doesn't, it gives you a chance to win the game. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. The Steelers head back onto the field with their offense. We're going to see if they can keep the scoring onslaught going as we've seen touchdowns on consecutive possessions here, Phil. Jim, these teams are so hot. And when you're hot like this on the offensive side, you just look at the coach and say, keep sending them in because we're going to make it work. The Steelers from the 27 throws the pass. Intercepted. An interception in the fourth that can completely change the tenor of this game, Phil. It did. You know, listen, there are a lot of special players in the NFL, and we just saw a special play by a special player. They got it done for them. The Lions take the field. The game is tied. And can this offense drive down and win it for them? Yeah, you got to be alert on the offensive side in situations like this. The defense knows they can't give up yards. They can't give up points. So look for them to take chances and be very aggressive. Offense has not been hard to find in this one, Phil. These guys are making it look too easy out there. And I can tell you from experience, and we all know it's not that easy. But I'll tell you this, fun to watch. That little throw was good for only three, so it's now second down and seven. Let's go! Red 38! Red. They'll run it here. Running room. And he's out of bounds. Somebody has to play the run game. Everybody can't go chasing the quarterback. That is a big mistake by the defense. Let's go. Always manage the football game. You got to be thinking about it all the time if you're the quarterback. It's a tie game. You're down in here in the red zone. Be careful with the football. You at least want to get three points out of this. Tie game in this one. Fourth quarter is winding down. Second and goal from the five. 
Simmons, that time all the stops. Stepping up, ready to go from the seven. The Steelers' defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Third and goal from the seven. Back to the ground. And Bernard is brought down. The Steelers in a tie game will call a timeout. They clearly want the ball back with a chance to do something. The field goal unit now has a chance to give them the lead here late in the fourth. The kick is good. They were thinking touchdown that entire drive, but in the end, they have to go field goal. They convert here in the closing stages. Well, I'm sure they would have loved to kick that field goal as time expired, but that's not the case. Good job of moving the football down the field, getting that field goal to put them ahead, and now the defense, go out there and do your job. That return is good for about 27. Spikes is at the head of the defense here that has a chance to close this game out if they can come up with a critical stop right now. A lot of talented players on this defense. We know that. They got some stars, actually. All you need is one of them to come through, make that play that's going to ice this game. And the sack belongs to Mincy. The Steelers, one timeout remaining. Every play is huge now. Second down on the way. The Steelers from the 22. Miller's going to pull in the bullet pass. A foot race to the end zone. That's reception number four for him. Tight end has not been a problem lately. This guy, as you can see by the numbers, continues to thrive. Ah, he's one of the best in the NFL, is he? And every week he just finds a way to get it done from the tight end position. Managing that clock, such a big deal in the NFL. That's why they're hurrying up. Don't use that timeout. Keep those timeouts because that is going to maybe give you a chance to win the game. The Steelers head to the line. They've got one timeout left in the game. Second down and 10. Browns touchdown, Pittsburgh Steelers. Finding the end zone for the second time. What an amazing finish to this one. A winning touchdown on the final play of the game. And what a throw by the quarterback. He put it right on the money. And a nice catch by the receiver. Awesome job on the last play of the game. So they've stormed back in the final moments to take the lead. And now they just need to hold on here as they get set for the kickoff. He's got a chance to return this one. And as he's taken down, that's going to seal it as they will not get another playoff in time. Calvin Johnson marching back onto the field now. And it's now or never for this offense, and you have to figure he'll play a major part in the closing stages of this game. Absolutely. This guy, there's nothing he lacks when you talk about talent. Size, speed, got great hands. Find a way to get him the football. Got to think the defense is wise to that as well. And it's going to fall incomplete. Their comeback effort comes up short. What a game it was. Comes down to a touchdown to win it at the end. Nothing like scoring late in the game to win it. When everything is on the line, the tension's there, the crowd's into it, and you make the play to win that game, it doesn't get any better. 